Hi, welcome to the castle. This is a short introductory video about the centre and climbing here. We're a mixed use centre. This means we house multiple types of climbing and training facilities. This includes bouldering, top roping, leading, auto belay and traversing. Each time you come to the castle, you'll need to check in at reception. If you've not climbed here before, you will be required to fill out a registration form. This should only take a few minutes and our staff will be on hand to help. There are two types of registration, bouldering only and rope climbing. As a bouldering only member, you are not permitted to use any of the rope climbing or auto belays unless you are signed in as a novice or register as a rope climber. If you're interested in our auto belay facilities, please speak to our reception team. In order to register as a rope climber, you must be able to put on a harness, tie in and belay someone safely. We offer learn to climb courses that teach you these skills. If you're unsure which registration form to complete, just ask one of our duty managers. Once you are competent to register for unsupervised rope climbing, you must upgrade your registration at reception. There is no charge for this. If you are registered for rope climbing, you can bring a maximum of two novices into the centre per visit. You're expected to remain with them at all times. Particular care should be taken when supervising children in the centre. If you are registered for bouldering only in the centre, you cannot supervise any novices. Once you've signed in, you can enter the climbing area. Remember, from this point onwards, you are responsible for your own safety. Our staff are here to help, but do not supervise your climbing. As you move around the centre, be aware of your surroundings. Beware of where other people are climbing and their landing zones. Take care to avoid obstructing them. There are a number of places in the centre where climbing may not be visible. For example, on the other side of an arch, corner or doorway. Always know where you're standing or climbing relative to other people in the centre and proceed with caution. When moving around the centre, you will pass through other rubbed climbing and bouldering areas. Look out for climbers' fall zones. If they fall and you are in the way, you will risk injury to yourself and them. When moving to new climbing areas, Consider whether that area is too busy. Please don't try to barge in or squeeze through groups of other climbers. This may result in accidents. Take time to read the good practice notices around the centre. Bouldering is the activity in which we have the highest rate of accidents. There is soft matting under the bouldering walls, but this doesn't make bouldering any safer. Sprained and broken limbs are common. As a castle climber, you can use our gym and training equipment. Please read all the good practice notes carefully and consult a personal trainer or member of staff if you're unsure. Training equipment should only be used by experienced climbers. It's easy to injure yourself using this equipment. In addition to all the indoor climbing we have to offer, there are a number of facilities you can enjoy during your session. We've got an award-winning veggie cafe and community garden. The castle shop has an extensive range of shoes and other climbing equipment. When the weather is nice, you may want to climb on our outdoor boulders located in the garden. Please remember, you must be a registered climber to enjoy this facility. We regularly hold events in the centre, some of which may impact your climbing session. You can keep up to date by following us on social media, subscribing to our mailing list and checking the information areas around the centre. The centre is always developing and on occasion we will need to close areas while this takes place. During these times, we will keep disruption to a minimum. Thanks for watching this video. If you have any questions, please ask the duty manager. They're here for your safety and enjoyment. Remember, climbing is a dangerous activity, so look out for yourself and for others around you. We look forward to seeing you at the center. Have a great session.